So Game Informer have just released their magazine that tells us a sneak peek of what's to come in Season 20 and shares a lot of awesome info as well as images of what we can expect. So let me just go over everything, kind of summarize it, but I'll leave a link in the description for you to go and read it because it is free to read. Now, first of all, we have some awesome images of the different maps. As you can see, this is for the anniversary event. They've kind of got a nice overhaul. We have these balloons in the air as well. Um, some of the gravity cannons have been reskinned. There's a blimp as well in the air but yeah a completely reskinned recolored look for the anniversary event honestly it looks pretty nice but we're here for the big big changes so they share here about the brand new legend progression system that's right if you look at this image right here, you can see the whole new perk system in a nutshell. So you start with grey armor, and you can level it up, and when you level up, you'll get a big notification saying you're leveled up, and you actually earn XP to level up by doing many things such as getting damage, getting kills, knocks, surviving with your team, and actually... Don't worry if you're someone who doesn't do a lot within the team. Let's say you're more of an assister. Well, it's okay because the person with the lowest armor does start getting an underdog bonus to their XP. So if you have gray armor and your teammates have purple, you will get extra XP for everything you do to help you boost and catch up to your teammates. Now, every time you level up, you get to pick between a different perk. You can see here, you get two choices per level until you get to red armor. Honestly, it looks great. You'll see the perks will pop up in the bottom left where you can see it all. Um, yeah, the perk system actually looks really, really good. Now, they did mention something about Watson healing with her pylons. I don't know if that's going to be a perk. I'm not sure what they were trying to say there, but that's an interesting one. Now, moving on to some of the new modes you were probably wondering about. So, there is a mode called Straight Shot, which is Battle Royale, but much faster paced. Basically, your team will spawn in the map at a specific POI. No skydiving in, you'll spawn on the ground immediately ready to go. There's going to be smaller rings and all the weapons you find on the ground will be kitted out in different rarities no attachments to find whatsoever super fast paced battle royale and the straight shot game mode allows you to requeue without even going to the lobby they're really taking casual fast paced apex to another level and i'm here for it not having to go back to the lobby and wait for your silly queue times being able to just spectate and instantly queue into the next match we can also see images of course of some of the new maps but these are mixtape maps you can see right here this is the new Thunderdome. It looks pretty cool. It will have a reactive crowd in the background. And they also mentioned things that are coming after Season 20. They said during their playtest, they got a sneak peek of the next Skirmisher Legend. That's right. The next Legend, they're not coming in Season 20, but maybe in Season 21, we're going to get a brand new Skirmisher Legend. So stay tuned for that. And they also mentioned the new map will also be coming in the future. But there you go. Thanks Game Informer for sharing. And hopefully you enjoyed this early look at Season 20.